So this is Megan's sister. Her name is Samantha. Now this is obviously her half sister. This is Thomas's daughter. And when Megan was born, I think Samantha was like 17 years old. Samantha also wanted to be an actress and she pursued it but was not successful. She unfortunately has MS so now she's confined in a wheelchair. And I'm sure we can all understand she's very jealous of Megan. Now, if you have a sister, you understand when I say this, that I have a sister and she's a stupid bitch, but only I can say that. Nobody else is allowed to say that. Them two, they were never on that level. Samantha called Megan a narcissist and selfish as early as November 2016. That's when the news first broke that Harry and Megan were a couple. So I'm sure a lot of you can relate to this. If you grew up in a low to middle income household family and you get engaged to a prince and you're going to be married, people are going to dig up all your sordid family history. I know if I was engaged to a prince, they would dig up a lot of family drama and they would be like, listen, you cannot marry this white trash bitch. And they would be valid. But most of the drama that came from Megan was between her father, her brother Thomas Jr. and Samantha. And this is, in my opinion, don't come at me, is where Megan kind of missed the mark a little bit. Because we all have black sheep in our family. And the best thing that she could have done is just invited them and gritted her teeth and just kind of stuck them somewhere. Just to be clear, she was absolutely valid not to invite them. But I think if she did, it really would have saved her uh, a lot of heartbreak. Because when they weren't invited, they were like, all right, fuck you. Who can I talk to to talk all the shit that I want about you? Samantha went to Twitter and complained. Thomas Markle wrote an open letter to Harry saying that you not inviting us is the biggest mistake in royal wedding history. Like, <laughs> okay. And he also goes on to call his own half-sister jaded, conceited, and selfish. And then we have her dad, Thomas. Thomas sold fake pictures of himself getting ready for the royal wedding um, and then never went. Now, what exactly caused the rift between Thomas and Meghan? I don't know. Because everything that I could find shows that he really doted on her growing up. He sent her to a really good private school. He paid for a lot of her um, college at Northwestern. And he just was, all in all, this really great dad. Apparently, he was upset that Meghan never brought Harry to meet him and he felt like she was embarrassed of him but I don't really know but no matter what your opinion is of Megan her dad did a lot of really shitty things